The Duke of Sussex has publicly spoken out about his father numerous times this year with the same reiteration that Charles has stopped taking his calls or helping him deal with his complaints about the firm. In his new Apple TV documentary series The Me You Can't See, Harry accused his family of total neglect while explaining to Oprah Winfrey why he wanted to leave the royal family. Earlier this month, he also tore his father apart during an interview for U.S. actor Dax Shepard's Armchair Expert podcast when he said he wanted to break the cycle of the pain and suffering he faced while being brought up with his own children. Now Royal Watching Twitter account at UK Royalty claimed Harry and Meghan appeared to be desperate to speak about their strained relationship with the Prince of Wales as it may be the only way left to get his attention, even if it means attacking the Queen and the rest of the royals too. They said, for now, Harry will continue to do whatever he can to get a response from his family, even if it ultimately dilutes their brand and destroys the legacy of the Queen. Meanwhile, royal expert Robert Jobson said Harry has behaved shamefully in recent weeks with his claims about his father. He said, I thought it was pathetic actually. He was hell-bent on blaming everyone else for his problems and mainly his father. He attacked his father, then he attacked his grandmother and shamefully his grandfather, who has just been buried. I understand why Harry has to make a living but does he have to make a living continuously whining on about his family and the woes he believes were inflicted upon him? It comes after sources claimed the Queen was also left, very upset, by Harry's very personal criticism of the royal family over the LSAT few months. An unnamed source told Mail on Sunday. Harry's grandmother has taken this very personally and is deeply upset by what Harry has said. In particular his comments about Charles's parenting and suggesting his father knows no better because of how he was brought up. It has been a very upsetting time. Harry told Oprah in his new TV series that he left the firm with Meghan due to the royal family's silence over their issues, particular from Charles. He said, Every single ask, request, warning, whatever it is, to stop just got met with total silence or total neglect. We spent four years trying to make it work. We did everything that we possibly could to stay there and carry on doing the role and doing the job. In the documentary, Harry also told Oprah his family did not speak about Diana's death and expected him to just deal with the resulting press attention and mental distress. He said, my father used to say to me when I was younger, he used to say to both William and First, well it was like that for me so it's going to be like that for you. That doesn't make sense. Just because you suffered doesn't mean that your kids have to suffer. In fact quite the opposite. If you suffered, do everything you can to make sure that whatever negative experiences you had, that you can make it right for your kids. He added his family told him to play the game and life would improve. But he said he refused, as he added, I've got a hell of a lot of my mum in me. The only way to free yourself and break out is to tell the truth.